so-called black Hispanic school of Israelites. I know this sister, you've been here for a minute now. All praises to the most high. So what's the reason why we're at the bottom then? We're at the bottom. Any and every neighborhood you go to, you see the so-called blacks and Hispanics at the bottom. Right. That's true. They tricked us. Right. Right. <laughs> That's true. Real quick, let me get uh, Daniel 8 and 25 real quick. That's true. They definitely tricked us and say, no, they come in peace and everything, but then they destroy us. They feeding us uh, lab grown meat now, or they about to, right? They've been poking at our chickens and beefs with, with a bunch of GMO nonsense. Right, right. All that nonsense is why, why, why are they, why are these people not trying to look out for us? Why are we at the bottom? Off of right, 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 right. That's true. Bring us out. The book of Daniel, chapter eight, verse twenty-five. And through his policy, also he shall cause crap to prosper in his hand. Right, right. He shall magnify himself in his heart. He shall what? He shall magnify himself in his heart. Uh -huh. And by peace shall destroy many. And by what? And by peace, peace shall, shall destroy, destroy many. many. That's what the so-called white man. That's how they operate. By peace, they say, "I come to you." Did they, they do that to the so-called natives? Second Maccabees 7 and 37. I'm listening. No, no, yeah, no. Everything is meant to work against us. Like a lot. I mean, There's ways to try, but they don't teach us this. Right. Meaning the yoke, my sins, I can't get away from my sins. Anything that I do, I always get put down because of my sins. Keep going. They are wreathed and come up upon my neck. Right. He hath made my strength to fall. Yes, what? He hath made my strength to fall. The most our God made our strength to fall. Because we keep sinning, it's gonna keep on going. Go ahead. The Lord hath delivered me into their hands. What the Bible says? The Lord hath delivered me into their hands. Uh -huh. From whom I am not able to rise up. From what? From whom I am not able to rise up. Most our God gave us over to these people. We're not able to rise up against them because why we keep on sinning. Bring this up. It's the book of 2 Maccabees, chapter 7, and verse 37. Oh. But I, as my brethren, offer up my body and life for the laws of our fathers, right. beseeching God that he would speedily be merciful unto our nation, right. Keep going. and that thou by torments and plagues mayest confess right. that he alone is God. Right. And that in me and my brethren, the wrath of the Almighty, right. which is justly brought upon all our nation, right. may cease. Right. And that's what we out here. We pray that the Most High God will bring mercy upon our people because we keep on sinning, and we try to we, we try to get our people to understand. We gotta come back as Israelites and stop sinning. That's really is a, the the solution. It's not to find out the next crypto that's coming up. It's not to. Uh, 
have an oil plant or whatever. It's not to do whatever, have gold and things like that. These things are not going to work because we tried all of that, right? I, could, I know Venezuela have a, bit, a lot of oil over there. It's right next to right? So these guys, what, what's happening? What's going on in Venezuela right now? Yeah, all starving. hungry. They're starving. Right? It's supposed yeah. to be one of the richest countries right. according to the standards of but, modern day, you know, so-called 2023. But they replaced the communist puppet there, so they right, right, exactly. So you know, what I'm saying he takes the government takes everything while right. the people are starving. Right, and, and that's and that's a curse on our people because we keep on sinning. Do y'all know what sin is? Well. I mean, not the exact definition, but I have an right. idea what it is. I got you. Yeah, yeah. We got it for you right here. The book of 1 John, chapter 3, and verse number 4. No. No. Whosoever committed sin, transgressed also the law. What the Bible says? Whosoever committed sin, transgressed also the law. Uh -huh. For sin is the transgression of the law. What the Bible says? For sin is the transgression of the law. That's what sin is. The transgression mean when we break the law of God, the laws of God, that's what we that's when we're in sin right and our people we're the only people although everybody else is living in sin we see the so-called white man they homosexuals they killing and raping and robbing murdering murdering people right but nothing is happening to them right. they still uh are living good actually real quick let me get psalm 73 and so that verse 3 right they still living good yeah. but our people we're we we're suffering yeah. we tried to their schools, go to their schools, academies, try to go to their jobs, try to be politicians like like they like themselves, but nothing ever happens. And that's a perpetual thing all over the earth. Now we see now the Chinese people, they have their own government, but they they prospering. Why they not in, why they not curse like us? Cause they're not the chosen people. Okay. The chosen people are the ones that's cursed. Right. Now now we see the same thing with the Arabs. The Arabs, they got all you and things like just like Venezuela. Right. They billionaires almost every damn one of them that you see is a billionaire, right? right? So why Venezuela is not like that? I mean, we I'm curse, cursed. we curse because of the curses. That's right, right. the reason why. Bring this out real quick. The Book of Psalms, chapter seventy-three, and verse three. Yeah. For I was envious at the foolish. What the Bible says? For I was envious at the foolish right. when I saw the prosperity of the wicked. Right. For there are no bands in their death. For what? For there are no bands in their death. Uh -huh. But their strength is firm. Right. They are not in trouble as other men. What the Bible says? They are not in trouble as other men. These other nations, they're not in trouble like us. We're the ones suffering out here. Right. We're in the neighborhood, in the in the hoods. How, how I see it, America's a trendsetter. So, yeah, exactly. You know what I'm saying? With all this gay stuff that's happening, right. they're trying to influence the rest of the world with the same nonsense. Right, 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 yeah. right. With their policies, they try to, you know, uh, overtake the whole earth. Right. But guess where did they, where do they start doing that nonsense at? Here. Here, right? right? In the hood. Yeah. Where they try to push it on our kids. Because yeah, they, they know that we're the, we're the real people that's real trendsetting and, 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 and whatnot. Right. What we dress, everybody else starts dressing. What we say, everybody else try to say the same way as we say. So that's why they try to get us. But at the same time, in the, at the end of the day, we got to understand that these people are not for us. And we got to come back and actually come back to the Most High God as Israelites. It's very important. It's very important. Right, keep going. Verse number five. They are not in trouble as other men, neither are they plagued like other men. Right. Therefore, pride compasseth them about as a chain. Right. Violence covereth them as a garment. Right. Their eyes stand without fatness. Right. They have more than heart could wish. They what? They have more, more than heart could wish. They could feed every single people on earth right now. Right. The so-called white men, they, they... There's no such thing as overpopulation. Right. There's no such thing as famine. Right. All this is bullshit. Right. Right. right, exactly. It's just to keep us fear mongers. Exactly. Yeah. But the, well, I'll say this, though. Yeah. There is famine that's coming. They, it's orchestrated by them, of yeah, course, yeah. and also the Most High gonna, you know, he's the ones making them do that right. because there's a because our people, our people gotta come back and actually, you know, let me get this real quick. Romans 13 and uh, 11, because again, we're out here letting you know this is the way to life, right? Keeping the commitments, being an Israelite, you are the, you are the king, the judges of the earth, and this is the way to life, and also. The whole earth about to go into symbols, yeah. right? World War Three is coming. Yep. What? How? How can we be saved out here? And, and if we don't have our own army, if we don't have, we already know these people. They're not looking out for us. Why not? So, it's unity, 
Well, unity, but is our people unified? And even, I say this, even when we did unify, what happened? Did Ecuador get their independence? No. I mean, technically, yes, on the books, but I'll be right. honest with you, none of us. I mean, there. but yeah. Ecuadorians, everybody, they, 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 uh, unified at one point they were unified at yeah, one yeah, point i would say at one point yeah right but look at what happened in, what's happening now it, there's, all, there's just a lot of violence a lot of gang violence right happening, a of lot course of, a lot of spread of drugs right 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 because because the so-called white men that's what they push yeah right I, Brandon, yeah. right real quick it's the book of romans chapter 13 and verse 11 right. and that knowing the time right that now it is high time now what that now, now it is high time uh -huh. To awake out of sleep. To do what? To awake out of sleep. Uh -huh. For now is our salvation nearer than when we believe. Now it's a high time to awake out of sleep. Yeah. Right? We see World War Three on the rise. Right. We see famine on the rise. We see, you know, and, and life as we know it is about to be shut off. Right? COVID, uh, tw back in 2020, that was just a little taste of what's really about to happen they say the next shutdown it's not gonna be no coming back from it so we now is a hard time to wake out of sleep because again we tried unify we tried some a lot of our people they became they got money right from crypto so from uh, uh option trading people have their own businesses and things like that now they, they have a, we have a lot of new found millionaires but it's not going to save us in these last days how you gonna how's that gonna save you when uh, how's that how would that save anybody because they're gonna shut down the money yeah right i mean money has been floating around for a while right right like, it's not backed by anything it's not right. even backed by whole right so again the only solution for our people is to come back to the most our god right, right. as israelites right, right. That's li that literally is the our only so uh, uh, solution. Right. Let me get let me get that uh uh first chronicles 17. Yo, my people if they humble themselves. Seven is seven to twenty-one. Come on. understand life and because the Bible preaches it tells us what life is about literally God is not gonna leave his children without uh, without without understanding without the knowledge of life or whatnot because he's the author and he gives it to us but it's for us to follow it it's for us to open up the book and actually go and you know read for ourselves and actually you know serve the Mosai it's the book of second chronicle chapter 7 and verse 14 yeah. if my people which are called by my name right. shall humble themselves shall, what? shall humble, humble themselves, themselves. Uh -huh. and pray right. and seek my face right. and turn from their wicked ways right. then will i hear from heaven then what then, then will, will i hear, hear from, from heaven, heaven. Uh -huh. and will forgive their sin and will heal their land if we humble ourselves and, and ask forgiveness right. Right. and come back because again sin is what transgression of law right. to break me simply uh, put breaking the law yeah, yeah correct. right so we just gotta stop breaking the laws of God. This is why Christ came and died. Right. This literally, when he says, go and sin no more, he's letting you know, go and break, don't break the commandments anymore. Right. So our job is come, well, our job, yeah, us is spread the word, but our job as a nation, come back to the most high and keep his ways and then we gonna be safe no matter what. Right, you guys got a flyer? Rafaya, <laughs> brother, what's going? Right. It's a, it's a, dim, yeah, yeah, it's a Spanish channel. It's two different channels. That's why we gave it. Right, 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 right. You got any questions though? No doubt. You guys always here, or you guys have your have your own like meetup spot somewhere? Yeah, we always here on every Saturdays uh, from. Like from from 4:30 till whenever, till like sundown. Yeah, man. All praise to the Most High. All praise to the Most High. Take care, brother. All right. You guys have a great night. Sorry about that.
Yeah, yeah what's your nationality? Oh, Asher. <laughs> right, you're an Israelite. Yeah, yeah. Israelite yeah. from the tribe of Asher. Yeah, right. That's why you got to you, you gotta keep that in mind. Right, because you. that's how you're actually going to, you know, start practicing and rehearsing these right, righteous acts and actually come back. We, we got some, I didn't go into the commitments, but we got some commitments in the back, back of the flyers so that you can, you know, start practicing. I got you. Right, right, right. It's been very insightful. Thank uh, all praise to the most. High. Uh, tune in and then, you know, you're going to find out even more. We'll all right, brother. Y'all have a good one. All right. Appreciate it. Hey, brother. Brother with the red hat. No, don't, don't, don't record him. Don't record him. Yeah. Yeah. Doing all right. Doing all right. How are you? All praises. Right. of the sun. All right, so Actually. that's true. Right. And that means every day as a God that, that for that day that the heathens worship, correct? The, the, wait, say that again? My that bad. would mean that every day, like, so whoever worships the sun, right. then God would be the sun and they worship on Sunday. Monday would be the moon. So that's only in English, though. Indeed, but what I'm saying is even if, if it's only in English, every one of these days has a specific being that people thought was God at one time and that they worship. Like Thor, Mars, all these days is actually God for that day. Right? Right. So my thing is, it's only in English though, remember that. If we doing this Saturday, right. so what's the God Saturday? Now, I'm gonna say you about to say Saturn. <laughs> Saturn. I don't, I don't know. I, know. I got you. No, no. Yeah. I mean, that's the understanding that people usually go by when it comes to Sabbath. Real quick, let me go, go to uh, Exodus 20, 20 and 8. Bible, good job. Exodus chapter 20 and verse number 8. Right. Remember the Sabbath day right. to keep it holy. Right. Six days shalt thou do labor and do all thy work. Right. But the seventh day, but the, what? But the seventh day uh -huh. is the Sabbath of the Lord thy God. Now, the seventh day, I read that for a specific, specific reason. The days never were named. Right. right. They never were named. It was always named first day, second day, third day, all the way up to the seventh day. Only the seventh day was called Sabbath. Right. right? Now, you speak Spanish. But you, you, you know, you, you're familiar with Sabado, right? Sabado means what? Sabado literally is means Sabbath in that Span in in Spanish, right? So it's only again, it's only in English where you find Sat Saturday where it says Sat Saturn Day, right? Only in English. I speak French Creole. Samedi, that literally means Sabbath day. Samedi. Yeah, well, in French, in in in, uh, um, in French, right? It literally means Sabbath day. Now we have a whole list right here of different languages. Armenian, the seventh day they call it Shabbat, which is Sabbath. Ukrainian, 
right? They go suba, suba, subota. So that's a list. That's a list of all languages. Yeah. The same the, the day we know as Saturday, everybody knows it as Sabbath day. So it's called Saturday because it's originally Sabbath. It's yes, Sabbath. Sabbath. Yes, exactly. Right. That day has has always been called Sabbath day, always. It never it never got changed and whatnot. Right now, it's afterwards when everybody else started uh, taking on what the so-called white man was saying. They starting to not call the other days first day, two, uh, 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 second day, whatever. They started having other names for their for their other uh, for the other days. But Saturday always been Sabbath day. That's through everybody's culture. So now you just read and it says keep the Sabbath the, the sixth day. Right. So that's telling me that. Days was never meant to be named. They were meant to be counted. Like we can look at the moon and actually see what day of the week true. it is in the month. Very true. Right? So if my my whole thing is if Sabbath is so crucial, then I think and um, and and you are, I've never seen this and I see that almost every nation in the world right. had an idea that this is something special. Right. But when it goes to that exodus, there's no means. It's straight numbers. Nah, but it gate it says we just read it. It's it's the no, Sabbath day. I know, but I'm saying we supposed to be counting days, not naming them. No, 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 no. It it's, it's read it again, Bob Exodus 20 and verse 8. Remember the Sabbath day to keep it holy. What? Remember the Sabbath day right. to keep it holy. Right. Six days shalt thou labor and do all thy work, right. but the seventh day is the Sabbath. Of the Lord thy God. So if it's no names, when we know. Nah, it just know. named it though. No, but I'm talking about the other days. <laughs> right. We talking about one day. Right. That's the only day we supposed to be right. really respectful. Now, if 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 you just woke up one day and you didn't know it was Wednesday, how do you know when is the seventh day? Let me get uh. So this is why I come three up and six. With, uh, the number in the day. We supposed to be knowing what day it is by the day. Of the day. Now, do you know that though? What you mean, well, no. Can you do that? I believe that. No, no, it's not believing. Can you actually do it? With the, with the new I movie? believe you could. I could do science, this science and things like that. I could put right. chemicals like this. I, I, whole fire. But I know. can you know? Can you do it though? I'm gonna tell you how. Okay. On the Appreciate new moon. It. Right. How do we know it's the moon noon if no one ever told us it was the moon noon? visually? Right, the moon, the moon cycles. <laughs> but which day, which which cycle is it? It's only one out of 28 days. What so do you that, mean? That would be the new moon. Wait, re repeat that real quick. The new moon comes once a month. Right. Every 28, 30 days. Right. If you didn't know well, if it was Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, because you said no one, it was a time where there, these days didn't number. How do we know when is the sixth right. day? You gotta go according to the moon cycle. Now, let, let's check it real quick. Now, the uh, Saturday was never changed. Right. That Okay, now the days, they just put names on them now. Right. They never changed them. Hold on real quick. So that cycle never got tempered with. That's the whole point. Now, for, for new moons, new, uh, today could be new moon and then tomorrow becomes a uh, regular Sabbath. And three other days become regular Sabbath day. That's right? That's true. Because that's in the Bible, we, feel we could go to 1 Kings right. 19. Say that one more time. So it could be a new moon today, right? Right. Which would be a Sabbath, technically. Right. And then three days later, it could be a, a Sabbath again. Right. Because of the moon. Right. So that means that technically every six days is not the Sabbath. But guess what, though? Yes, it is. <laughs> Sabbath, real quick, real quick. Sabbath literally means day of rest. Right. That's, that's it. Hold when? on, real quick, real quick. When? Now, there is a... There is a weekly day of rest that everybody is supposed to, you that's, know. That's what I'm talking about. Listen, real quick. That's the regular Saturday. But uh, also, there is a, every once a month, there is a Sabbath, which is uh, a new moon, which is when everybody else is supposed to, you know, do their thing. Real quick. Any In any feast days, let me get uh, Le Leviticus 23. You can start at the top. Every feast days... There is a, there is a, it, it's called a Sabbath day because you're not supposed to do no type of work, no nothing right. or whatnot. But get, it, don't get tripped up over the name because, because, because it says it's a Sabbath day. There's, there is the Sabbath day and there are, you know, days, days 
of rest. There you go. Days of feast days. Real quick. Leviticus chapter 23 and verse 1. And the Lord spake unto Moses, saying, Speak unto the children of Israel, and say unto them, Concerning the feasts of the Lord. Concerning what? Concerning the feasts of the Lord. Like with an S, multiple feasts. Go ahead. Which ye shall proclaim to be holy convocations. Even these are my feasts. Right. All these, and there's a whole list of a bunch of feasts. A holy convocation, you don't do no type of work because it's a holy convocation. Now, the Sabbath day is a holy day of rest and things like Because on the feast days, you can cook. On the Sabbath day, you can't. Right. On the feast days, you can uh, enjoy yourself, right? But on the Sabbath day, there is uh, certain ways you got you, you got to go about it. I'm particularly speaking about the weekly Sabbath. Right, right. Rest from, work, from the day of rest. Right. That's something we gotta do weekly. Right, right. Now let me just I'm just tell you what I think. What I think. Go ahead. What I, my I'm understanding. Just, right. I'm just, my understanding is the new moon is the beginning of the month. Right. That day is when the when, when we count the days of the Sabbath. So when a new moon comes, six days later, the, the seventh day we rest. Right. And we just keep doing that. No, you can see If we, b before, like who, who invented Tuesday or Thursday? Right. Romans, Greeks, whoever that was that invented that, we didn't practice that. All we did was watch the moon. And the only day we knew like when was the seventh numbers. day was the new moon. And the new moon is got to be the most important day in the month because it tells you when the Sabbath is. Right. Every new moon is when the Sabbath is. Six days, the seventh day of rest after the new moon is the Sabbath. It ain't got nothing to do with Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. All it got to do is the new moon. I got you. Now, now I, don't, I could be wrong. More than likely, I probably am. But I feel that there's other people that feel that way. And for the people that's trying to understand, that's a big, that's a big sense of confusion amongst the camps. Right. It it now, it, it, it will always be. I mean, first first Samuel's 19, I mean 20. Let me see real quick. 20 and you can start that verse. Let uh, me just ask y'all that. Do y'all believe con, 24. the new moon that is actually telling you when the Sabbath for the month? Is? No, no. That's and that's why that's what I'm about to show you right real quick. Because again. A new moon, it can't be new moon and then, uh, I mean, all right, from your understanding, is new moon, that's a, it's a start of the clock for the so days, right, 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 for right for the month, the right? Sabbath, First day, day, I got you. I got you. Seventh day after the, okay, that, exactly, you said it perfectly right there. But that's not biblical, though. Bring this up. Verse Samuel, chapter 20, and verse 24. So David hid himself in the field. And when the new moon was come, right. the king sat him down to eat meat. Right now, the new moon came. David went and hid himself in the field because he he heard that King uh, King Saul was about to murder him. Right. right. So David went. Right. He went there and and go ahead. And the king sat upon his seat, right. as at other times, right. even upon a seat by the wall. Right. And Jonathan arose, and Abner sat by Saul's side, and David's place was empty. Right. Nevertheless, Saul spake not anything that day, right. for he thought something had befallen him. Right. He is not clean; surely he is not clean. Right. And he came to pass, like it, and it came to pass on the morrow, which was the second day of the month, right. that David's place was empty. Right. And Saul said unto Jonathan his son, right. Wherefore cometh not the son of Jesse to meet? Neither yesterday nor today. Now you can rest right here. Actually, go now. Go to twenty-one and one. Now go to the next chapter. Now tomorrow is the second day of the, of the month. No, but that's not that's not uh, the point I, I want. Now we know we see that King. It was new moon right there. You see what he did. I got you real he quick. Counted the second day from the new moon. Yeah. Brother, if it's well, today what July first? Tomorrow gonna be July second. That doesn't mean anything though. No, but no, no, he just said the second day of the month, not of the week. Hold on. Right. No, 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 no. It's just shown because that's how you you go about uh, your feasts. Hold on, though. No, we gonna see. We gonna see. Now, he said he said what well, he he said the new moon was there. Now and David went and hid himself. Hold on, went and hid him hid himself in the in the field. Go ahead, bring this up. Verse Samuel chapter 21, verse 1. Then David to Nob to Amalek 
the priest, and Amalek was afraid at the meeting of David, and he said unto him, Why art thou alone, and no man with thee? And David said unto Amalek, the priest, the king hath commanded me a business, and hath said unto me, Let no man know anything of the business whereabout I send thee. Right. And what it's like it. I have commanded thee, and I have appointed my servants to search, it's like it, to such and such as a place. Now therefore, what is under thine hand? Give me five loaves of bread, it's like it, in my hand, or what there is present. Right, keep going. And the priest answered David and said, There is no common bread under my hand. There is what? There, there is, is no, no common, common bread, bread under, my, under hand. my hand. Right. But there is hallowed bread. There is what? There is hallowed bread. Right. And the young men have kept themselves at least from women. Right now, the priest says, There is no common bread under my hand. It's hallowed bread. You know what that is? That's like, um, uh, like sacrifice bread. Yeah, that's the soup bread. Let me get Leviticus 24 and 5. You can't eat it. Right, it's it's only it was only made uh, for the priests on the Sabbath day. Right, on the Sabbath day. Now read read that part again, Bible Kishon. Verse four. And the priest answered David and said, "There is no common bread under my hand, right. but there is hallowed bread. If the young men have kept themselves at least from women." Right. And hey, that's now. So the book of Leviticus, chapter twenty-four, and verse five. And thou shalt take fine flour right. and bake twelve cakes thereof. Right. Two ten deals shall be in one cake. Right. And thou shalt set them in two rows, six on a row, upon the pure table before the Lord. Right. And thou shalt put pure frankincense upon each row, that it may be on the bread for a memorial, even an offering made by fire unto the Lord. Right. Every Sabbath, every what? Every, every Sabbath, Sabbath, every when? Every, every Sabbath. Sabbath uh -huh. He shall set it in order right. before the Lord right. continually. Now, every Sabbath, that's when they make that soup bread. Now, remember, David said, and we know that David, David went into the field on the new moon. Now, that day right there that he met the priest, now, in, in uh, 1 Samuel 21, has to be the Sabbath day because he got the soup bread ready because that's the, every Sabbath, that's when you get that bread ready. That's when you put that bread together and put it before the Most High. Now, go ahead, read on with that. Verse Samuel 21 and verse 5. And David answered the priest and said unto him, Of a truth, women have been kept from us about these three days. About what? About, about these three days. How long? About, about these three days. days. Uh -huh. Since I came out, and the vessels of the young men are holy. See that? Since he, came, he was out in the wilderness for three days. Right. And when he went to the wilderness was when? On the new moon. So three days later, it was the Sabbath. Because of the bread. Because exactly that that instance, that ritual, that that instance, uh, he encountered with the priest that was on the Sabbath day. So that bread is not there every day. Nah, it's not. No, no, no. The Most High is very meticulous about things, you know. And there's none left over the next. Day. No, no, no. So it has to be yeah, that's that's for the Sabbath day, like we just read Leviticus 24. So these these. Uh, um, so these bread, uh, I mean, these guys, they were keeping a new moon, and then three days later, it was the Sabbath day. So it cannot, so the new moon cannot start the beginning of the week. Now that could happen, and let's say there was a, a feast. Let's say it was a new moon, and then three days, three days later, it was some type of feast. Right. That technically would be a Sabbath in, in, in the next three days. That happens all the time. Let, so how we don't know that that happened? That didn't happen. No, no, no. All right, so, but it doesn't matter. I don't see how that conflicts with what this says. No, what I'm what? trying to say is basically is that before the days were named, we didn't practice that because it was it was basically idolatry to us to say any day was some other god's day because each day is named after heathen gods. We never did. Holy day, look at the new moon, count seven days from that day. No, no, we, that's not how we, it, how it went. We always, literally, uh, literally, when I said, you can look at the, uh, you got Exodus still? Ezekiel can't, so like Ezekiel 3 and verse 6. The book of Ezekiel chapter 3 and verse 6. Not too many people of a strange speech right. and of a hard language whose words thou canst not understand. Right. Right. Surely, had I sent thee to them, 
they would have hearkened unto thee. Right now, real quick, the part I wanted is like we we not we we speak in English now, right? We understanding each other right now, right? We don't speak the old language that we used to speak, the Hebrew, the Paleo Hebrew, and we then sure don't have the understanding we used to have of nature. We we used to look at the stars and know that today is Saturday. Not because of of, of the new moon we counted or anything like that. Uh, uh, I guess that's what you were trying to say. Oh, the, the, there was counting. It's not because we used to literally, real quick, real quick. It's not just the it's not the the stars there there are certain certain stars no real the stars tells you a lot too the stars tell you a lot too go to get somebody get it's a car I used to get them the moon is telling us the time season and days we can look at the shape of the crescent and I can say if this is the second week of the month if it's on this side I know it's the last week. I got you. That's the moon strictly, but the stars as, uh, as well, the constellation as well, it speaks a whole lot as well. Bring us the book of First Chronicles, 12 and verse 32. Yo. And of the children of Issachar, right. which were men that had understanding of the times, right. to know what Israel ought to do, right. the heads of them were 200, and their brethren were at their commandments. Right. Of Zebulun, such as went forth to battle. Real quick, you can rest right here. Now, Issachar. It's a call. They had the. They, they were real good with that. They got, they because got, they, they get the. Can somebody get the account. Anybody know the account where it's a car, They told them don't go to battle and whatnot. Baba They had the most accurate calendar ever, right? Uh, right, right. Real quick, real quick though. They, these guys, they understood the times because they understood the stars. They understood the the constellation and everything. So now again, we don't have that knowledge anymore. But the Most High still looked out. He still, you know, we keep, we we have the days still going. Hold on real quick. This, the days never got tempered with. Now, we cannot say, oh, now, because uh, the, the days now, they have, uh, they are named after false gods. We can't, uh, we can't really trust this, that, and the third. We can't say that. What we could say is that we actually know how to figure out when the new moon is just by looking at the but can you figure out the days of the week? Like, how? Because the new moon is the only day in the month that doesn't appear. No, no, no. The new moon tells you. The new, the moon tells you the. Uh, the new moon tells us that the the the, the, the new month. Right. That's it. Right. So it, and it's the beginning of. The but month. a new month doesn't mean a new week. That's the whole point. But it's the the, the new month begins the new week. Do you know? No, it doesn't. No. No, it doesn't. How? And, and, month, you know, do you know? Month, okay, okay, real quick. You ask me how. Let me okay, got it, got it, got it. Because bad. the month begins on a new moon. Right. Every new moon, it's a new month. And we know from that, and we know that's the day that we don't see the, the moon in the, in the sky. Every day we can see the moon in the sky. There's one day out of 28 days that there's no moon at all. It's not 28 days. 30 days. It's, it's 29 and a half. But you know what I'm Basically, saying. Basically, there's but, a three-day right. difference where one of those days you're not gonna see not even a slither of the moon at all. That's right, that's a new moon. From that day on, that's the beginning of the month. It's the beginning of the week. From so that day you count seven days. Real quick. The Sabbath is every new moon. So the Sabbath, so it's always seven days, right? Always. Okay, now according to your knowledge now, well, 29, there, real quick. Unless there's a, a feast coming. Uh, hold on, hold on, real right, quick. Today was a new moon. This doesn't make sense. Real quick, listen real quick. Right, the math does not add up at all. 29, let, 20, uh, 29 days, right? It's 29 and a half, we'll just say 29 days. Divided by seven. It's, it has to be a, comp that's, that's four times, 4.14. What is that saying? That's that, four times. But there's, there's, months. hold on, hold on. There's four weeks, the four times, that's four weeks. Hold on, no, 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 no. But there's three more days. There's like two, three more. That, okay. I, I, I want to put. You got to remember. I wanna, I wanna, day, actually, I'm going to put a calendar. I'm going to pull a calendar. As a matter of fact, you said that it's a I'm going to pull a calendar. I'm going to pull a calendar real quick. Look, look, the real quick. Didn't have real quick, real months. quick, real quick, real quick. Let's say, like, let's say this is the beginning right here, right? First week, first week, seven. Uh, first week right here, seven, 14. And uh, what's this right here? 14 plus <laughs> 21, my bad. 
uh, 21 and then 28 and then there's one there's one more day one there's one more day and a half a day and a half left so what happened to those to that day and a half you forget that the seasons where we are on the earth the seasons uh, change listen every every season there's off three days yeah, uh, no, no, but every season. But that's. But g- guess like, what though? Like guess what? That's not. There's no such thing. Right, there's saying, no such thing, this man. Is what I'm saying. The Bible strictly says on the seventh day we got rest. How do if if th- if there was a time for thousands of years we never said we never named days we were specifically. So what world. happens to the next two days of that month? Because a month is. 29 and basically 30 days. 30 so what ha- what ha- right 30 days. Now, what happened the to those 30th, next 2 days? The, the, the 30th day, the next day is going to be the old new moon. No, 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 no. But uh, so what happened to the uh, 29th day? What do you mean 29th day? 29th day. Cuz you said we know it's 4 weeks in the month, right? I know that every seven but, days from the new moon is Sabbath. No, all right, all right, okay. I, I hear you. Months. I hear you. Now, now, listen, listen, though. No, never said months. Now, he never said months. He said January, February. He never named months. Uh, all he said was seasons and moons. He doesn't have the month of a bid. He doesn't have the month of a uh, what's the month? A a dar. He has a he has all twelve months named in the Bible. I don't know him from the top of my head, but I know that he has all twelve months named in the Bible. All right. Now, if we if we really look at it, when we was looking so at this, one? it was ten months. It was ten months, not twelve. No, 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 no. Before this, before Rome, it wasn't twelve months a year. Uh, you bring yourself up. The Book of Sirach, chapter forty-three, and verse number six. He made the moon also to serve in her season for a declaration of times and a sign of the world. For the moon is the sign of feast, a light that decreases in her perfection. The month is called after her name. In- the month is called after her name, increasing wonderfully in her changing, being an instrument of the armies above, shining in the firmament of heaven, the beauty of heaven, the glory of the stars, and ornament, giving light in the highest places of the Lord. So the moon is created to tell you when the month, the feast days is coming and all that stuff. It didn't say when the Shabbat is coming in. It said feast days. But now, run this out real quick. Now, if there is 12 months, First Kings chapter 4 and verse 7. And Solomon had 12 officers. Oh, and Solomon had 12 officers. How many? Had 12 officers over all Israel, which provided victuals for the king and his household. Each man his month. Each man his month in a year made provision. 12, 12 months. So now we cannot say, well, you cannot say this. You cannot say, oh, the 29th and the 30th, 30th day is not counted for anymore because those days you cannot. I mean, you have to say they don't count. You have to say, oh, those days don't exist in order for you to go about your, uh, your understanding of saying, yes, you do. Because again, first seven, first seven, second seven, then then twenty one, then then twenty eight. I mean, listen real quick. And then after twenty eight, there's supposed to be two more days. What happened to those two more days? Now, what if what if after those two two more days, there is a new moon? That, according to y'all, there's there is a, another new moon that's coming. So there's a week of two two days. There's this week that's only lasts two days. There's such a thing. Sure, but do you understand what I'm saying though? I know that you know you can live in a certain part of on the earth and see no days. So brother, it's not depends, a <laughs> it all depends where you at. <laughs> no, brother. On the earth. It's not about it's not about no no brother. I, I know there's and some the, places where the, the, the summer, sun shines twenty four seven. The days are longer and the, and the, and the winter. The Alright, that's shorter. the cycle though. That's the moon and sun cycle. That's it. What I'm saying is Tells you of months, of. but does it say it's the beginning of weeks? Well, how can it not be the beginning of weeks? It's the beginning because of the we just showed you how David, hold on, no, we just showed you how David was keeping the new moon, right? Well, he didn't keep it, but the new moon came on David three days prior to when he, we, he, uh, um, he, three days prior to the Shabbat, 
Real quick, let me get uh, Mark 15 and uh, verse 40. So that verse 40. I don't expect it to be answered today. What? Okay. I don't expect it to be answered today. This is, like I said, y'all know other camps, they say a whole different thing. Right. All I'm saying is there's a lot of people that's asking the same thing. Now, one thing that he just said was that the moon was counted as a, as a beginning of the month. The month? Right. Why are you stuck on that because you read that? Because it's telling you that how many weeks Why are you not stuck on the King David? How many weeks in the month? How many weeks in a month? Right. About like four, four and change. So it's four and change. Well, you know? so it's about you know four and change. I mean, how do you know when it starts? Huh? Right, I mean, we, 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 but the. Hold on. How do you know Hold on. Hold on. It starts by the moon. The new moon. So you can't say. No. Right, right, right. The, when the moon is dark, we we know that. No, no, I'm talking about but, the beginning of the month. You said it starts, it, it begins of the month. Okay, that's the that's month. Four weeks. That's the month. And we know it's four weeks. That's the month. month. Okay, okay. So the week begins, in the, the month begins in the new month. It's moon. just 30 days. A month right. is 30 days. Okay. It doesn't, it doesn't necessarily, look, 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 look. Like, let's say today, it's the week, today is the first, the first uh, of July, right here. And there's one, two, three, four weeks in between, and then there's two more days in the next week coming, before the next month come, comes in. But now, that's just, uh, uh, say there's no 31st because we know there's no 30 31 days but right here that's literally still one now, two three four five there? six no hold on how many times brother brother days? stop stop the list brother just listen just listen I'm real listening. quick i'm reiterating what you're no, telling me but brother we know there's, there's no it's only 30 days. days we know there's only 30 days we counted 31 brother who all counted all 31 all of us no <laughs> who, who's that priest you got the priest up for that for the 30 days, no Bible can shine. No, brother, it's not about the month. Does not start the week, brother. It's simple as that. No, the month could co 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 come in the middle of the week, in the beginning of the week, in the end of the week, but the month does not start the week at all. So if the month comes in the starts in the uh, middle of the week. Then it's good. the cycle gonna keep on going until it ends wherever it ends. It sounds like you're looking at two different calendars. Brother, no, I'm not. Cause we just saw how the month, the new moon came, and King David had uh, uh, the Sabbath come in af right after, three days later. Bring this out real quick, Mark. It's the book of Mark, chapter 15, and verse 40. There were also women looking afar off, among whom was Mary Magdalene. And Mary, the mother of James, the less and the less and Joseph and Salome, right. who also, when he was in Galilee, followed him and ministered unto him, right. and many other women which came up with him unto Jerusalem. And now, when the even was come, right. because it was a preparation that is the day before the Sabbath. Now you know what when this is. This is this is the uh, the day before the Sabbath. The, uh, uh, Preparation day after the uh, feast of Passover. Next day is the, the feast of Passover. Uh, three days. Read, read, read the uh, verse 15, verse 42. And now, when the even was come, because it was the preparation that is the day before the Sabbath. Right. Now, this is actually when, right after Christ died, right. Right after Christ died, on us he died on what? On Passover, right? Right. And Passover is a what? It's a Sabbath, and it's what? No, 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 no. no. This it's the fifteenth. Is it fourteenth day? It's the fourteenth day of the month. The Passover is the fourteenth day of the month. Now, right of the month, the fourteenth day of the month. Now, right here, after he just died. You know what I'm about to say. The next day is about to be the Sabbath day. So how could the 14th day, which is seven, seven, you count seven, right? If y'all right, the 15th day is the Sabbath day. Hold on, according right, according to this right here, the 15th day is the Sabbath day. Brother, brother, the 15th day of that month is the Sabbath day. Is the Sabbath day day right here? Is that 
I'm th I'm thinking but do you get I'm a question I'm a question for you sure. suppose the new moon fall <laughs> Wednesday right okay. so that's the new month eh? all right that's a new month so the Thursday gonna be Sunday again now so no. start all week so it's confusion then brother right like that's I never said that when I, all right. but that's what you're saying when you're I'm gonna tell you you just said let's say the new the new moon comes on the Wednesday right that's the beginning of the new of the new month yes what I'm saying is that the Saturday Seven days late. But no, that means if you go by seven days, so Sunday would be Thursday then. That would be confusion. I, I'm, I'm not That's counting confusion, Thursdays and Sundays. I'm it's counting confusion. new moons. I got and every seven days for the new moon. Don't get, and that's what I don't like. Don't get caught up in the names. We just read right here again, 14th day from the new moon, from the new moon which is when you celebrate the Passover, right? Is when Christ died, and then the next day. So let me ask hold on, this. the next day is the actual Sabbath. All right, let me ask you this. Then. So how could that be? If that was 14 days after the Passover, right? I mean, that's which is the Passover? 14th day of the month of Bib. That's 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 uh, uh that's, that's the Passover, the moon, right? 14 days after that is the Passover. In between that was the Sabbath, right? You said what? Well, read really say it again. The, the, on the, the first of the bid is the new moon. Right. 14 days later is the Passover. Right. This, which is the supposed to be probably the biggest day of year for us, right? Uh, one of them. In between that was the Sabbath, right? Right. And well, what they day? said it had to be. It had to be, right? Right. What day was it? Now, I don't know. It was seven days after the first no. of the bid. Okay, so if it's seventh day after the first of the bid. Right. Okay, now the fourth. Hold on, hold on. Is after okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Now, if it's the seventh day after the month of a bib just came in, right? Now, seven plus seven is what? Fourteen. Which is what? The Passover. The Passover. Now, right here, read it again. Read, read verse 42 again. Uh, this is Mark 15 and 42. Yeah. And now when the even was come, uh -huh. because it was a preparation, uh -huh. that is the day before the Sabbath. That is what? That the day before the Sabbath. Christ died the day before the Sabbath, which was the 14th day. Now the next day is the day we, is the Sabbath day. So I thought it was the 14th day. I'm not Come sure, on, brother. I'm not, I'm not it makes sure. no sense, brother. It's it makes not, no, no sense. Not it's not all right. You just don't want to accept it. You just no, I, I know I know brothers don't like Esau to have it so much that they don't want to follow. I know that. I understand that. But it, it just don't let it get uh um uh, what's that? Go to uh Sirach 19, Bible Kasha. I know, I know it's your turn, but it's like no, 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 no. Okay, Kaka, Kaka, Kaka. Let's start right 19 at uh. But I'm showing you. Uh, that. 20. This is where you confuse right. that. Chapter 19 and verse number 20. Yeah. Yeah. 29, 29. Verse 29. A man may be known by his look. Oh wait, hold on, hold on. That's not. That's not the one I want. Nah, nah, nah. Damn. Uh. Overthrow you, yeah. Evil suspicion, con, 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 con. Evil suspicion overthrow you, yeah, 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 yeah. Con, con. It's the book of Sirach, chapter three, and verse number twenty-four. Con. For yeah. many are deceived by their own vain opinion, right. and an evil suspicion have overthrown their judgment. The Bible say? And an evil, evil suspicion, suspicion have overthrown, overthrown their judgment. judgment. And evil, because we understand, yes, Esau's wicked, but our judgment gets overthrown when we, because we gotta understand the most out, we are cursed, right? We get everything from Esau, even his Bible, we gotta get it from Esau. So even some certain certain understanding which we know that Esau has, we gotta get it from, from them. And the days, they never change that. They change just the names of the days, and then they change the names of the month, and that's it. And then they kind of and, and and they reset it, that they just reset it, that that's it. But but the days never changed. The cycle of the days never changed. The cycle of the week never changed. Never did. Never did. Never. That's why people still call Sabbath day Sabbath in all other languages. Now, again, well, bring this up real quick. Huh. Yeah, this is Genesis chapter 7 and verse 11. Yeah. And the 600th year of Noah's life in the second month, the 17th day of the month, the same day where all fountains of the great deep broken up and all the windows of heaven were open. So on the second day, of the uh, 17th day of the second month, that's when the flood started. Verse 24, and the waters prevailed upon the earth 150 days. So the water was on the earth 150 days. Verse three, 
And it says, and the waters returned from the earth continually. At the end of the 150 days, the water were abated. And the ark rested in the seventh month on the 17th day of the month upon the mountains of Ararat. So there's been a five month interval, right? 150 days. When you do 150 days divided by five months, that's 30 days each month. There's 12 months in a year, according to 1 Kings chapter 2 and verse 12. So there's 30 days in a month, there's 12 months in these uh 12 months in a year. That's about 360 days, right? But so again, if if the new moon going about the new moon, that's when you find out the the start of the week, you would have to explain the last two days. Right, right. Right, it's the start, exactly, it's the start of the month, not the week, but you're saying it's the start of the week as well. Because you're saying it's the, it restarts the week. No, I never said that. But that's, that's but the understanding moon, of it, the though. The new moon only comes, uh, <laughs> what I said, you, by what you're saying, you're saying that only, the Sabbath is only on the new moon. That's no, not no, what I'm I didn't say that. No, 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 that's not what I said you said. No, no, that's not what I said you said. What I'm saying is, it's only one new moon out the month. Right. That's it. Right, right. The Sabbath is on whatever day the new moon lands, the Sabbath is that day for that month. Right, right. Now, if there's any feast days that come in between that, then, you know, we, we, like, let's say um, there's a, a feast day where we're allowed to cook and we're now not to cook, right? All feast days we're allowed to cook except for the uh, Day of Atonement. So they're, but they're both considered Sabbaths. Right? right, right. It's a feast so day, one, a holy convocation. One, the weekly Sabbath is to keep us resting from work. That's not a feast day Sabbath. Right, right, right. But there's no cooking. There's no right, 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 right. But what I'm saying is, and, I'm, and I and I represent a lot of brothers that I speak to brothers that really ain't trying to hear this shit at all. Come. And I tell them, listen, man, there's something in this. And then they'll bring things up, and I say, and one of the things they bring up is this. And I say, listen, they all got different beliefs. It is what it is. You gonna have to ask them. Let me get Isaiah from 52 and 8. From, from, from. Now, I, I can't lie. No, I don't. I'm not an expert. I have read, and from what I've seen right. so far, I think the new moon is, is more important. Than, than people. It's not just a, a, a day that says the Sabbath for the week. It starts the month, which starts the week. No, it doesn't start the week. So I was right. My statement was right then. Because what I'm saying, it doesn't start the week. If, it, if, if the month, if let's say the Sabbath is on Monday, right? A new moon is on Monday. Right. right? That means every Sabbath is going to be on Monday for the next four weeks. Until the next new moon. That could be on a Wednesday. But we that just means, saw how, no. how Christ, after he died, the new moon, I mean, the, the Sabbath came after, uh, came a day late, a day late. A day late. You're right, meaning it came on the 15th day. And what Sabbath was this, like a? A regular Sabbath. A, a work Sabbath? A regular Sabbath. Regular Sabbath. A weekly seventh day. Sabbath. Right, right. Although it never really specifically said, right? I mean, it says, it says it's a Sabbath. So, what I'm saying The Passover, they just celebrated the Passover, the first day of the Passover. And then the next day, uh, uh, by sundown, is, you know, the Sabbath. So I'm going to leave it there, you know Real what I'm saying, because I don't, I, right. I, I just need more scripture. I got, well, we, uh, we've been trying to give you some scriptures, though. So. That's all we did, re getting, really. Getting, but I, I, I got you. I understand it's hard to hear and, and whatnot. And I'll say this, don't let that. Just because this camp says this, that camp says this, we say, no bro, I got you. I'm just saying, just because brothers are not seen eye to eye, there's a reason for that. Right. It's only when Yahweh Shah comes back. That's the only time we're going to bring that, bro. That's why I think it's important. It's the book of Isaiah 52 and verse 8. Right. Thy watchmen shall lift up the voice. Right. With, thy, with the voice together shall they sing. Right. For they shall see eye to eye. For what? For they shall see eye to eye. Right. When the Lord shall bring again Zion. When what? When the Lord shall bring again Zion. That's the only time we're going to see eye to eye. Brother's going to say, ah, man. I'm keeping a new moon like this. I'm keeping a Shabbat. As long as you're doing things uh, righteously, right? So right. You are rehearsing the righteous acts, right? Or it, as long as you're, uh, uh, you know, you actually sincerely doing it, right. you actually sincerely believe it. But yeah, how, there's a lot of things we don't know still. There's right. a lot. Everybody have we see in part. We know in parts. We prophesy That's in parts. Me. Right. I probably know the least. I started off saying more than likely I'm wrong. 
Right. Because I know the least. But what I'm saying is this is it's something that obviously the kingdom not coming till we get it right. No, 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 no. That's not, no, 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 no. That's not what he just said. He said when Christ comes, that's when we're going to get it, we're going to actually get it right. So he's not going to come till we get it right? We're never going to get it right till he comes. That's, that's the whole point. We're never going to see out of eye. Are you like, going to stay there? Sakura going to stay there? Watch for Israel going to stay there? Hawa going to stay up to this chariot fly? There's nothing that we're not gonna see out of eye. It's always I as UPK definitely not gonna be jamming up with GMS. We know that. It's it's all good though. It's all good. It's all praise to the most high. As long as we understand that and we trying to rehearse some righteous acts, probably you got you got judges? solar cycles see that since the beginning of creation it's that's hard. when it started no that's see that i knew that's what he was going to captivate it says it started it no it says read, read again that part the jew week had its or what? the jew week had its origin or the origin of the week and the creation account right and in the creation account, that's when, since, since, when you, yes, when it says in the beginning, uh, the right, right, the most high created the earth, and, right. right, light, there was light, all that stuff, right. right, that's when the week started, and it never been, and ran consecutive, it's like consecutively, right. irrespective of lunar or solar cycles. Right, it ran consecutively, irrespective of lunar and solar cycles, it never right. changed. The sun and the moon never stop. It always goes. It never changed. Since that day, that's when the week started. And that's how amazing the Mosai is. Even in so-called 2023, we got cars now. We got phones, cameras, fitted caps. And yet, some the days never change. This is Iraq, chapter 43, verse 10. No. At the commandment of the Holy One, they will stand in their Order right. and never faint in their watch. And never what? And never faint in their watch. That's all about the sun and the moon. They never change faint in their watches, man. They always do what exactly what the Most High God called them to do. Bring this out real quick. The book of Judges, chapter five, and verse eleven. No. They that are delivered from the noise of archers in the place of drawing water, there shall they rehearse the righteous acts. There shall they rehearse the righteous acts of the Lord. And that's what we're doing. We're rehearsing the righteous acts. Right. Again, don't let camp camp doctrines get you messed up. No, no. no. Right? You know most are willing, we all, so real quick, most are willing, we all seek out exactly what makes sense to us and exactly what, you know, actually is true. And most are willing, we could, but I'll say this. Every, every camp got something that, that's, that, that, that they're off about. Every camp. So we, we still got a ways to go. We st of course. Only when Christ comes, that's when we're going to know the truth. As long as we're all sincere, right? Absolutely. And we're uh, uh, willing to. Because, again, in the second wilderness, too, a lot of people going to get jammed up because they're going to feel they're going to try to stand ten toes down and not not trying to be conformed to the way of the Mosiah at the end of the day. You don't want to be like that, man. You got to be like water, right? That's what Bruce Lee said. You got to be like water. Right, be like water. Or go to a bottle, go to a cup. I got you. I got you. And, and something that seems so serious.
what's up? Rehearse? You actually rehearsing the righteous acts? Hey, yes, you're doing good. The Most High have grace and mercy on all His people. I hope He does, because I honestly. Now He does. He does. I'm not trying to come combat, brothers. No, I got you. I'm telling you that I really don't know at all. But when I when I read it, this what came to me. Other people spoke to me. They got all kind of craziness. I said, you gotta speak to the brothers. They know more than probably anywhere they're gonna go. Come. But the, the people y'all trying to speak to, this what they say. They might not be telling you, but they'll tell somebody that like me because I'm still with them. I, I respect what y'all doing, and I'm saying now nah, you, you gotta listen to these brothers. They got something good. But there's brothers that's lost. They straight out the bush, they don't give a fuck about anything. Right. So if I tell them, you know, you should pay attention, they gonna listen to me. Right. And the first thing they all say, well, how are we gonna follow them if none of them is following the same one? Who, who do we go for? And I say, yo, brother, I don't know. That's like actually what church goes to. You gotta find it out for yourself. Right, right. But one of the things that came up, and, and I heard it more than twice, was the old Sabbath. Right, right. And I, I, you know, I don't know. I looked at it, this what it, this what it sound like to me. Right. So that's why I'm coming to ask you guys. I got you. So you know what I'm saying? Now, I'm gonna go back and tell them the same thing. They're gonna say, look, they didn't agree with what I said. Right, I right. felt that it was every seven days. Right, right. But, you know, it looked like we gotta read some more. Right, right, it's, it's not about uh, what agree with what you said. It's about agreeing with the scriptures. Right. The scriptures showed us it can't be like that. It's consecutive and histor historical points, and also documented historical points like uh, uh, the Compact Bible Zonovan, whatever. Right. So these are the ways. But at the end of the day, again, just gotta be sincere. Absolutely. But I appreciate it. I think Romans chapter run. two and verse twenty-eight. For he is not a Jew, which is one outwardly. Right. Neither is neither is that circumcision, which is outward in the flesh. But he is a Jew, which is one inward, and circumcision is that of the heart, in the spirit, and not in the letter, whose praise is not of men, but of God. Come, so that's that's how you follow the Most High. It's not about necessarily try knowing. Best. So what? Try our best. Right, right. You if gotta you to try. You gotta try your best. Be sincere and actually put your fo best foot forward and keeping His ways. Right. right. You keeping the Sabbath day, whether by the new moon, which is incorrect, but. You keeping it by the new moon, or you keeping it by uh, the weekly? Okay, as long as that's your understanding. But you have to. One thing I'll say though, you gotta do those things though. You gotta keep the Sabbath. You kept the Sabbath. I keep, I keep the Sabbath. I don't work on the Sabbath. I don't buy. Okay, all praises, right? What about uh, why you don't wear you don't wear fringes? That, that's another thing. That's a whole. That's a whole another show. Right, so, were you gym? Are you talking about GMS brothers? Nah, like I said, I don't really deal with Oh, you don't want to? Okay. Now I'm saying, like, the people that you be dealing with, you I be talking to? everybody. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Actually, to be honest, I fuck with y'all more than all the kids. Okay, all praise to the most uh, at the I, head of the Every time somebody asks y'all something, y'all give them scripture. Other camps, they seem to regurgitate the shit that they heard someone else say. Right, right, right. No disrespect to them, but. Right, right, right. But you gotta understand, you say you fear the Lord. Actually, let me get uh, Sirach chapter 2 and verse 14. I you fear the like, Lord, you gotta start keeping his commandments. It's just that, again, this is what the first thing I asked was the most important commandment. I got you. So it shows 16, I'm trying. I just think our understanding is still too new. Got you. It's got the got book you. of Sirach chapter 2 and verse 16. Yeah. They that fear the Lord. We'll seek that which is well pleasing unto him. Right, which is what you're doing, you're seeking out, right? And they that love him shall be filled with the law. Right. They that fear the Lord will prepare their hearts and humble their souls in his sight. Right. Saying, We will fall into the hands of the Lord right. and not in the hands of men. Right. And hey, you fear the Lord, you're gonna be filled with his law. Right. You're gonna be filled, you're gonna prepare your heart, you're gonna try to actually follow the Mosah. And Actually, actually following him is not just singing and it's not just you know seeking and seeking because you got to start somewhere because also well yeah you got to start somewhere it could be some simple as fringes that's keeping you from getting a uh you know the conviction that that needs to happen about what where whatever confusion you have right it could be it could be anything as simple as that not so, following them will, 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 will cloud your judgment. Right, exactly. Get the classic Psalms uh, 
What is it? One, one ten, verse eleven. What is it? One eleven. Psalms one eleven in verse ten. Uh, the fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. Right. A good understanding have all they that do His commandments. That, what? that, that do, do His commandments. commandments. Right. That do His commandments. Simple as that. I'm with right. Just go ahead and get you fringes, zizis, whatever, however you go about it. And then you start keeping the, uh, you, you you got your new moons already, right. and you got your sabbaths. Most I will, and you will, you will come to the under. Say you do more research, and that I use. Did you see? Did you see? Did you see the um, WFI Sabbath utterly? What what they named that? Name it. Right, uh, lunar Sabbath uh, uh, utterly obliterated. Con. Check it out. It's like four hours of just good old info on it. On the Sabbath. Yes. Precept upon precept. Doctrine upon doctrine. I said that it's, it's a full confusion. I mean, God it, put so much emphasis it's on not, it's, but it's not, it's not, it's not a lot of confusion because literally the four hours it literally compacted in what we just uh, uh, said just now. Just breaking that, they go into all the accounts, all the accounts that they know that's known to men. They go into them, making sure to, to you know, beat the nail inside of you know, let them know, like yo, this is right, what the Sabbath is. So what is the new moon? The full moon or the crescent? <laughs> the crescent, the, the, the dark moon. All right. Yeah. All right, right. That's that's biblical. But um, you got you got it. You got to reach it. I caught that one. Right? Following the other one is is completely off. So real quick, slide. You know what? Following the full moon as the new moon would that be completely off? I mean, yeah, because it's not biblical, but we know certain certain camps like IUIC. That's what they do. Right, right. Come. So, Rag chapter 21 and verse 11. Yeah. He that keepeth the law of the Lord, right. get it the understanding thereof. What did the Bible say? He yeah. that keepeth the law of the Lord, get it the understanding thereof. Right. And the perfection of the fear of the Lord is wisdom. See that? When you keep the laws, you get the understanding. Right. Alright, uh, you got it, brother. It. All praise to the Most High. Let me get Baruch. You're right. For most death. Give, let me get Baruch 335. Yeah, yeah. Fly about for sure. I got a lot of questions. The book of Baruch. Chapter 3, verse 35. This is our God. What the Bible says. This, this is, is our God. God. Right? And there shall none other be accounted of him in comparison of him. Right. He hath found out all the ways of knowledge. Right. And hath given it unto Jacob. Unto who? Unto Jacob. Uh huh. His servant right. and to Israel and to, who? And to Israel, Israel, his beloved. Afterward, did he show himself upon earth and converse with men? Come. Second Maccabees chapter two and verse seventeen. You know, we hope also that the God that delivered all his people right. and gave them all inheritance right. and the kingdom and the priesthood and the sanctuary, right. as he promised in the law will surely have mercy upon us right. and gather us together out of every land under heaven right. into the holy place for he had delivered us out of out of great troubles and have purified the place. Okay, and with that, we pray that the Most High God gonna deliver all Israel out of all troubles, right? right? The Most High gonna deliver us and actually give us back what he promised our forefathers, the land of, of, of the so-called Canaanites, what the Canaanites, right? And we say, Go to America! Go to America! And go to